So China's crypto crackdown is intensifying. Here's why you should worry. Hello, I'm Rachel Jones and you're watching Kalkai Media. In a fresh jolt to the cryptocurrency market, China's central bank said on Friday, September the 24th, that all cryptocurrency transactions are illegal in the country. The central bank wants to crack down on the market. And this is not the first time China's taken strict measures against virtual currencies. The People's Bank of China says that token issuance, crypto trading, order matching and derivatives for cryptocurrencies are now prohibited in China. The People's Bank of China has also banned overseas cryptocurrency exchanges from providing services in mainland China and has termed them also as illegal. The central bank says that overseas crypto exchanges using internet services to offer services to Chinese nationals will fall under the category of illegal financial activities. Apart from these exchanges, financial institutions and non-bank payment service companies, they're not allowed to facilitate transactions related to cryptocurrencies. This move is expected to change the face of the cryptocurrency industry. We could see a cryptocurrency market crash. And since reports surfaced about the central bank's decision, the cryptocurrency market has been trading in the red. And it is expected that the prices of cryptocurrencies will decline sharply. As altcoins were rising and seem to be entering a bullish zone, China's move impacted them more than traditional virtual currencies. Crypto-related stocks have come under pressure due to this move also. One of the largest cryptocurrency companies in the world, Coinbase Global, recorded a decline in its share prices during pre-market trading. Now, such decisions invite bearish sentiments, and this means that people would be scared to invest in crypto assets and that will decrease the number of buyers in the market. Also, during a sell-off, a large volume of cryptocurrencies may be sold within a short space of time, and that can cause the price of the virtual currencies to decline rapidly. There are also long-term impacts of China's crypto crackdown. So far, countries with poor economies have shown interest in adopting cryptocurrencies as legal tender. The adoption of Bitcoin as legal tender may appear as if the acceptance of cryptocurrencies is increasing globally, but that's not the full picture. With China's intensive crackdown on the crypto industry, major countries may follow suit and adopt strict measures against the virtual currency industry to keep things governed centrally. Central bank digital currency could become mainstream. Everybody may not want decentralization and countries in favor of centralization could support China's move and start rolling out central bank digital currencies. China already has its own CBDC called the Electronic Chinese Yuan, a digital payment and processing network run by the Central Bank of China. This is expected to completely replace physical cash. Now, if you like this video, please like, share and comment. And you can also subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can press the bell icon for notifications for our latest videos. And for more information, log on to our website, calkindmedia.com. I'm Rachel, signing off for Calkind Media.